So guys, I am back with another How Divers 2 video and today guys, we have another big one, packed full of interesting things. We have brand new missions tied to Super Earth, a bug container backpack, new weapons, as well as a brand new patch, which hit the World Wide Web, probably about a couple of hours ago, actually dropped when I was asleep, but today we get into it all. Now the winner of yesterday's 2100 super credits giveaway you can see on the screen. Now, if this is you, hit me up on my Discord link down below. Now, do you guys want to win 2100 super credits or a copy of How Divers 2? It's simple. Liberate this video with a massive thumbs up. If we could smash 50 likes, that would be unbelievable. Also, make sure you are subbed with those post notifications turned on and leave me a comment down below. I will pick a winner from the comment section and announce them on tomorrow's How Divers 2 video. Okay, so where do we even start today? We'll start with the brand new mission objectives, Super Earth props, and even more bugs. Now these data mines come from the one and only mouse TTV over on Reddit and we're seeing on screen now guys some real, real interesting things. Now most of these are believed to be tied to new missions coming. As we see, we see carry flag, we see briefcase, we see the missile silo, the oil pump, we see the orbital cannon, we see raise flag, restore power, uh, satellite relay. These are, lot, like I said, a lot of things to do with missions that I know that are gonna come, but we also see larvae. Now this is something really, really interesting, which we'll move on to in a quick second. As I say, guys, this list goes on and on, and it's believed that these are gonna be a part of new content, new missions, these are all audio sounds that we will see and hear in the game in the future. So we're gonna move on guys, and now we see things that insinuate new missions regarding bugs or new bug missions, so to say. We can see here content objectives, bug stratagem blocker. What is going on there, guys? We see assassinate chargers, we see, we see deploy flag area, mark a bug hive. We see bug lava container backpack, which again is what we're gonna now move on to. This is very, very interesting. So if you look at this image right now on the screen, again, tied to one of these new missions coming. Now, see this kind of like terminal. This is no doubt where you have to collect this from or take this to. But what we are looking at here, guys, is if you look at this player's back, we can see a backpack container with a small baby bug or a lava inside of it, which is very, very cool. But it doesn't end there, guys. We have an actual fully textured model of this backpack, which we will check out in a quick second. Well, this is seriously, seriously interesting. Now, if we move on, we see content and we see Super Earth and we see Super Earth props here. Uh, we see speakers, vending machines, warning lamps, uh, colony building grounds. We see uh, forklifts. Oh, I'm terrified of forklifts, I'm not gonna lie. We see base lights, we see Super Earth caches, we see rocket walkways, we see retracting poles, we see all kinds of things. Now this will not be the first time we've seen Super Earth pop up in regards to a new planet or a destination. We will have to know that liberate again. We saw leaks and data mined images probably like two weeks back now. We saw an image or a collage of all the maps and Super Earth is right there in the middle of it. We've seen in-game ads where it states millions have been killed upon Super Earth. There's been audio files, there's been so much more in regards to Super Earth being a planet. We will have to take back and defend and liberate people. So yeah, this just adds more fuel to that fire. Now when it's coming, we have absolutely no idea. And you also must remember as well, guys, there's been plenty of uh, Super Earths upon my research and my understanding. Uh, once one Super Earth is destroyed, we move on and find our new home. And we also call that Super Earth 2. So yeah, so Super Earth will be a place, no doubt. And I cannot wait to see this in game. Now we also see with it Super Earth samples. I mean, what else do you need to hear? Super Earth will be coming, people. Okay, so we're going to move on. And we have this right here, Capital Defense Mission. Uh, this again, they state could be a reused asset. I'm not sure, but hey, just thought I'd throw this in. Now moving on, and this is terrifying here. We see files that refer to acid chargers. Acid chargers, people, now that is absolutely terrifying. Uh, we can see right there, acid, well, charger acid, charger bull. So hey, if chargers weren't enough for you, it seems as though they may spit acid, they may explode acid upon you. I have no idea. 
But yeah, so now moving on to further content, further new things coming. And this is in reference to the Illuminate enemy faction we know are coming into the game. So we can see here, content and objectives. What we're seeing here, guys, is no doubt a part of some kind of mission, some kind of objective on a certain map where we have to interact with a artifact maybe uh, and it states here that we may have to pick it up and the artifact has physics to it so yeah this is no doubt a part of some kind of objective on an illuminate infested planet yes yeah, so very very interesting people okay so we're gonna go back to that backpack and here guys on the screen again thanks to mouse ttv you see a few close-ups of this backpack looking very very interesting uh, i can't wait to see what mission is a part of but hey it gets even crazier people because the legendary iron sights has fully textured this backpack with that larvae inside of it with that small bug inside of it and it looks absolutely incredible again this will be something you wear on a, your back part of some objective or mission on a planet to come so yeah that's very very interesting to think about and on screen now again thanks to iron sights we can see the actual larvae animations of what it will do inside this glass container when you run around that battlefield and this thing is swinging about on your back so yeah very very cool guys next up we have a very interesting uh post again this was done by mouse ttv and it shows in game sort of like credit cards in regards to how diver credit cards not sure what these are it'll be just speculation right now there's not much information on it but we see a couple of these uh again i think they're called howbox cards or they're being referred to as howbox cards maybe these are just a new in-game currency we know new currencies are coming in regards to those research points maybe these are just another form of super credits in game maybe just get a boosted amount of them if you find one of these who knows guys but they're very very interesting we are seeing credit cards in game for the game like what and we also guys see this weapon right here this is believed to be a new model looks very very small i'm not gonna lie considering the handles more or less as big as the lily barrel but hey uh, very very interesting to see but it is pure basic model right here we can see the bullet underneath how big the bullet is in comparison but yeah an interesting to theorize over there's no two which ways about that okay so we're going to end the video on the latest patch that hit the game this was a patch promised last week due to all the problems we were having which they blamed on arc weapons so the patch of 1.000.104 states hello all small fix coming in today overview what's being done in this patch fix the arc based weapons fixes game no longer freezes when firing arcs from the following weapons and stratagems arc thrower arc shotgun and a tesla tower now this was the issue many many players including myself were having with the game crashing constantly uh, so yeah now I can jump back on and liberate people but yes there we have it guys a small patch for today I would have thought at least some of the known issues they spoke about in the previous patch may have been added in and fixed with this one, i.e. adding people cross-platform, things like that. But obviously, we're going to have to wait longer for that. But there we have it, guys, for another How Divers 2 video. Guys, if you enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully, guys, I will see you on that next one.